I mean, look at that. It's as big as my head. <laughs> it's like a, like a robot, right? Hi there, Danny Myers here with Lighthouse Video Surveillance. And I'm excited to share with you a brand new camera from Originalon. This is a, uh, a new form factor for them. They haven't done this type of a camera before. This is the, the corner mounted vandal, vandal proof or vandal resistant camera from Vigilon. So stick around. Hey, thanks for joining us today. Uh, the purpose of this channel is to help you get the most out of your security camera system. So I'm glad you joined with us today and excited to talk to you about this new camera. Now, usually when we're talking about a corner camera, uh, I'm usually thinking about a corner mounted camera. So something where it's on the corner of a building, um, maybe it's a 270 degree uh, camera that can see you know, on the, the corner. Uh, in this case, we're talking about a corner mounted camera up in the corner of a room. This camera is probably going to be used more so for places like, uh, like I said, jail cell. This is be, um, it's vandal resistant. It's really heavy duty camera. And um, so I'm, I'm picturing most likely this is going to be for places like a holding cell, a jail cell, maybe an interview room for a police station. Um, maybe a, a medical facility where they might be treating patients that might have mental uh, you know, challenges. And so they're looking for something that's vandal proof, but they can also record what's happening in that room. Purpose of this video right here is gonna be an unboxing. And so we're gonna unbox this thing, open it up, and then um, we'll have a couple other videos of us installing the camera, a video of some what the footage looks like from that. If, if you're new to this channel, I ask you would, uh, uh, if this video is helpful to you in any way, that you would, first of all, give it a like, that helps us put a comment on there. Tell us what you liked about it. Hey, tell us what you didn't like about it. That's okay. Uh, so, yeah, if there's something that we could do better for you next time, uh, we'll, we read those comments. We'll take them to heart. And uh, and also, uh, subscribe to our channel. Uh, Lighthouse, we're, we're a, a company here in Houston, Texas. We do work here in Texas for city work, government work. Um, and uh, so we'd be happy to be a resource to you if that's what you need. So let's get into this. Uh, let's get into this camera. Take a look at it. First of all, what I noticed, uh, I wasn't expecting such a big box. Um, whenever this came, <laughs> you know, I had in my mind for some reason it was going to be a much smaller box. Uh, maybe the pictures that I'd seen on the little promo videos and whatnot, but the camera box is really big. Uh, something else that I noticed, take a look right here. It has this little sticker on the front that says config. And when I saw that, I was like, you gotta be kidding me, that's pretty awesome. So we can actually pull this tab off. So it has a little tab that you pull up and it gives you a port right into the box. If you're, a, if you're a, an actual company that's installing these things, you're gonna see the value of that right away. Uh, a lot of times when we're installing these, especially on a big installation project, let's say we had 30 of these things, 30 different cells, this is for a prison or a jail or something. And you would have to take every single one of these cameras out of the box, open it up, plug into it with a patch cable, into you know so that you can actually pre-configure all these cameras. Let's say you're trying to get all these set up for a for city in advance. You're gonna have them all laying out on there on the counter. Well, you're gonna have boxes and pieces and bags all over the place. What this has allowed you to do is literally plug straight into the camera through the box. Then you can put your notes on the box or where it's going. Um, that's a great idea. I don't know if a vigilant came up with that, if they invented it, but that's a fantastic idea. So let's pop it open. First of all, you know, Vigilon has their really, you know, handy instructions. Obviously, it comes going to come with the package of screws and, and the little device to, to feed it through this weatherproof uh, grommet. You'll notice right away that this camera is very beefy. This thing is really heavy duty. Um, and if I were to set it on the table, you can hear this, this metal. I don't know if you can see that or not, but look at the welds on the metal. This is pretty, this is this is really nice. Look inside here where this cap, uh, this outside cap, is welded onto the to the body of the of the housing. You see those nice welds. I mean, look at that. It's as big as my head. <laughs> it's like a like a robot, right? Have you all have y'all seen the uh, 
the new Lost in Space. All right, let's pop this thing open. It's a pretty good show, by the way. It's on it's on Netflix. Check it out. All right. Dang, I feel like I'm opening up a safe. You know when you go to the hotel and you put your coat in there and you pop the door open? That's what I feel like I just popped open. This thing is really heavy. So you can see on here on the front, this must be the, uh, the infrared, infrared illuminator right here. And then it has the, the connections for the infrared illuminator on the back. And so when we're looking inside the camera here, when it comes, it doesn't come connected already. It makes sense. You would just connect that up. Uh, you connect it up after the fact. So if you see, here are those wires that go onto there. So it looks like we're probably looking at infrared illuminator and probably a, a microphone as well. I, I haven't really checked this the specs out on this yet. But I'll have that other that other video coming, right? So what we're looking at here looks like we have a, a beefy adjustment for that's your up and down adjustment. And remember, this is this is going in a corner, obviously, right? So if it's in the corner, it does it's not going to turn left and right. It's just going to go up and down based upon the the height of the room that it's in. Most systems, most cameras like this are actually being powered through a, through a network cable. So they're powered PoE, power over Ethernet, right? But there also is a connection inside here if the camera needed to be powered by um, 12 volt or 24 volt. And then there's also the port that's in there. That's that's a there's a, a micro USB port, and that is for uh, programming the camera in the field. Um, you know, connecting it to, like, to a mobile device. That's that's the main thing that gets used for. Um, cool. Well, I'm, I'm very happy with this camera. I'm really excited to see it physically installed. You know, I'm looking here, and it has... I see these little uh, grommets, if you will. Little, little These will pop out, I'm sure. And that's how you would be mounting it, is you're going to mount it to these surfaces. You know, so it's in the corner. And these are so you have the, the right wall, the left wall, and then the ceiling. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to go ahead and take this this camera and uh, remove it from its from the, the housing here. Once you get the, the the screw actually loosened, it has some really big heads on these screws, so you can use your fingers to to get in here. All right, so this rolls forward. You know, I, I did mention, hey, they give you great instructions for that, right? So instructions are, are it's a, they're pictures. Um, but what you also can, can do with these is that you see this little, this little code right here, this little QR code. You can scan that with your phone, and it can, it'll take you to, to more detailed uh, instructions. Uh, sometimes it's actually videos, like a video installation of this. Um, so great, great tools for installing. Uh, great. They supply great material for getting stuff installed. Okay, so back to what I was saying. Um, in order to install this properly, you're gonna need to take out this camera, and I'll show you how we put that back in there in just a minute. Um, but you see you have you have all these little these little um, uh, rubber grommets in here. That's where you're gonna have your screws to mount this. And then your hole, you know, ideally, Ideally, if you're imagining this is a corner, right? So this is the this is the uh, the ceiling, and this is one of the walls. You're going to have this corner like cavity. That's where you're going to want to have your hole that, that brings your wire in. Okay. Um, but I will tell you that if there's already an existing camera there, and that hole is not right in the corner, it'll still work out fine because there is a gap right here. There's a gap there that's big enough for a Cat5 to sit in there without any trouble. Not not the connector, right? But but the wire itself could fit in there without any trouble. All right. So uh, let me show you how to put this camera back in there. Once you have once you have this thing bolted up in there, it has this little has a little hook on the top of that, and then that hook just, just goes right on in. And it just it's basically it's now it's now holding the camera in place. You see that? Okay. 
And then this, just these just come right back and then those little screws go right there. Hey, while I'm, while I'm closing this camera up, uh, let me tell you something. Um, this is just one of many videos we're gonna be putting out on different uh, cameras from Vigilant. Um, for those of you who don't know, Vigilant Lighthouse, we are a, we're a premier dealer for Vigilant. Um, and so this camera is actually one that, we're, that, we, that we, we purchased ourselves. But we also, uh, Vigilant is gonna be providing us some cameras to take a look at, some demo cameras to test out, and we're gonna be providing you that material. So what I'd like for you to do is send us a message, send me a message, let me know which cameras you'd like for us to take a look at. Um, the ones that we have coming up, uh, we own a, a thermal camera, it's a demo. Uh, we'll be happy to show you that one. And then uh, really like to look at the pro, the pro line series cameras as well as the um, explosion proof PTZs that Avigilon has come out with. So um, if there's any other cameras that you'd like for us to do a demo on or do a, a, an open box uh, unboxing type of thing on, then just give us a, a message, put a comment, let us know in the messages, in the comments there. Um, as I wrap this up here, I'm going to close this back. Um, oh, this is obviously important to note. It has this little lanyard on there, and that is for whenever this is being physically installed, right? You really want to have that attached because this thing is heavy. Whenever this is physically installed, that's going to be leaning forward. So I'm going to make sure that they put that lanyard on there so that it'll, if it did fall out of their hand, it's not going to fall to the ground and break or, or break the, the IR or the, or the microphone or the dome. So there's a place where the hook's right in there, okay? Well, I think that's going to wrap it up for us here at Lighthouse, and uh, I hope that you enjoyed this unboxing. Uh, there will be, uh, right up here, um, we're probably going to have two videos. So up here on the on the, the top right or left here, whenever this video gets, gets uh, put out there, you'll be able to click a link that will take you to be able to look at this camera in more detail. We'll have it going physically installed and also have some footage for this camera for you to take a look at. So uh, we appreciate you joining us. And once again, if you, uh, if you found this material helpful to you in any way, hey, subscribe to our channel. Give us a like and put a comment there. And remember to trust Lighthouse Video Surveillance for your video security needs because it has to be right the first time. Have a blessed day. Ha, ha, ha.